Hello everyone, Serge Gabriel here. I decided to do another fear video, but this time I will focus on Cadence. This was actually introduced by Okami Place, who said, I have a, fear, a weird theory. Could Cadence be Twilight's real mom? Let's see if that was possible that Cadence was actually Twilight's real mother. But to have much about that, it's both seems a little bit strange, but I mean, even this was, even this theory was public. I mean, I don't know how many fans with any Brownie fandom would accept this kind of theory. But we do know that Kaden was actually in her early te early teens when she was babysitting or at least full sitting Twilight when she was just a Billy. So, could this mean Cadence could have been Twilight's real mother? Well, if we read a perspective from In Catlot Wedding Part 1, when we're seeing that Cadence was actually her full sitter, so I do not know how much many fans would say that's not even possible. She was an alicorn even when she's at the beginning, so if she was an alicorn, and since furry heart is an alicorn, so why wouldn't one have been an alicorn as well? That is the question. But even so, who would be at least Twilight's father? I would rule out Shining Armor immediately, because that means no possibility. Even if that seems Cadence and Shining Armor already known each other back then, but they wouldn't seem to not be dating, so Shining Armor will be ruled out as a possible father to Twilight then. But if Cadence were actually Twilight's mother, who would be that and much of the acceptance? Since we don't know much about Cadence actually bloodline of herself, since she was adopted by Kate Elisa, no, Celestia, she wants she was the Philly or something. And there was a point when she got her title as a princess and was granted to be an alicorn. But the only known family member we know about from Kate is actually her long distant ancestor, Princess Amor, the first known ruler of Crystal Empire. But what about Cadence as Twilight's mother? Well, personally, I'm not saying that there's a, not as a ruling out as a theory, as, as a possibility, but, but you have to, have to consider all per, all per point of view, all aspects, all factors, at least from all possibilities that could have been any remote possible, that Cadence could have been Twilight's real mother. But if we think it is possible that she could have been Twilight's real mom, what happened? What happened? Why, why didn't Cadence ra ra take care of Twilight by herself? Well, there might be a, some remote possibility that she was still young, perhaps in her early teens, maybe, uh, let's say she was only 15, 17 years old when she had Twilight. And that and since the father didn't want to be part of the family, or perhaps he didn't want to be a parent, and just left. And then Cadence wanted to raise her baby by herself, but at that time she was, was already granted as an alicorn before she even before she even had found out that she was a pregnant with Kate at the Twilight. But so did the Kate's how did Kate Celestia and Luna take it is actually? Well, no exactly Luna was in the was in around at the time. But how did Celestia take all of this news that her adopted niece is pregnant and that the father is long gone? There is a possibility, like many are in our world, there are many young parents, some could be around from 15 or perhaps even 18, who are still in school. Some of the parents might think they can handle this, and but they know parenthood isn't that easy. Uh, they think maybe making a, a, starting a family, getting a baby would be easy. 
but they are much as wrong as they can be. So even if the tw even if the cadence had Twilight as a baby, and she tried to keep her, tried to raise her, but realized even she lives in the castle in Camelot, even have access to all kinds of servants, people or opponents that can help her to help at least raise her, like being a fall sitter or at least look after Twilight when Cadence is away for uh, some kind of school or something. But that doesn't even make sense. What if that when Cadence were actually still in school and had Twilight and had to keep as a secret and for the rest of the public? I mean, how would the public react? How the newest princess had a baby daughter and none of them knows who father is, or at least the mother knows the father, but the father doesn't want to be part of the family. And how would Kate Shining Armor find out when she when they start new, when they start dating in school? Like finding out that Cadence has a daughter and he uh, she has never revealed this to him after they start dating. Most of parent new parents often doesn't want to reveal this to, to their new boyfriend or girl, girlfriend at the time. Because might some of them think you're a parent? And you never told me? And then they never sp speak ever again. But if that has happened, Cadence could only have maybe a few options left to, to how to take care of this. She could still go back to school as normal and letting the, the royal, royal staff, the servants, to, to take care of Twilight Mal during the day while she is Cadence in, at the school and when she comes back after the afternoons, then Cadence could take care of Twilight, and but then the Cadence have to rely on the servants, servants again when she has to take care of some royal duties with her adopted aunt, Celestia. But even if that is one of the possibilities, relying on the staff to take to take care of Twilight while she is gone, well, I have to say that might be could have worked, but we don't know if in the long term how that things that happen, because since we know the staff can have to take care of other things in the castle, like make sure the Celestia's royal duties are well taken care of, and who knows? Another possibility that then, even if the Cadence was still young and she perhaps felt that she couldn't take care of a baby of, of her own, even she had Celestia and the servants to help, but at the same time, that might be so much overwhelming to her, so it is a possibility. Maybe then she felt maybe that she could put up her daughter for adoption, but to realize she had to find a suitable parents or a suitable family for her daughter to raise her and raise Twilight as her own, as their own daughter, and perhaps even never reveal that she was actually adopted and that she was Cadence's secret daughter. But even if that happened, even if that Twilight was adopted by some family, soon the rumors were probably spread quickly throughout the, in the kingdom. Where is Cadence's daughter? What happened to her? Where did she go? Shouldn't she take care of her? Where did she adopt her away? She did adopt her, adopted her own daughter away. She couldn't take care of her. What kind of mother is she? What kind of role model is she? And as a princess, just abandoned her own daughter. That was a, could have been one of those reactions when the public would find out that if her daughter was real, came out as has been adopted away. But even if that was true, Twilight, no, Cadence would have to look up, perhaps. Any possible suitable parents or at least a, and a family that could have been any suitable for Cadence's daughter to be raised by. So if it is possible if that she had her daughter adopted away, it is very likely that she had to take Twilight's uh, no Shining Armor's parents, the Sparkle family, to be Twilight's new family. At the same time. While that she Cadence was still living in Candelot, she could still be looking after her daughter in a distance. Seeing her daughter growing up with a, a lovely family, having shining armor as a brother, always protecting her, always helping her with anything that she wants. And even then, when 
when I was a bit older, Cadence had offered her adopted parents to be Twilight's fall sitter, even if that seems to be strange that why would her own mother be her fall sitter? That could have been a little bit strange if I had to say it myself, but but let's assume that she did adopt an awake Twilight to to Kate uh, to her her adoptive family. How would Twilight react when if she finds out at some point that she isn't related to any of her family, that, that in fact she is a daughter of Cadence, and that she probably will ask, "Who is my father? And where is he? And why did you adopt me away?" Cadence probably had to say that she couldn't raise her because of that that she was still young and she was still in school and she had other role duties to take care of and that she had to be relying on the staff of the servants to take care of her. But at the same time, how do we know for sure that Cadence did want to keep her daughter in the first place? I think that Cadence did want to keep her, but knowing that how much she tries, it didn't want to work out. So, my theory that, or at least Okami plays theory if the Cadence could have been Twilight's secret mother, or real mother, I have to say that is a, might be a possibility. But unfortunately, that is just not canon in the, is in the show itself. But, but nevertheless, it's an actually a good theory. Could Cadence be in Twilight's real mom if there was a possibility? And I have probably had to say yes. It might have been a highly likely possibility that Twilight could have been Cadence's real daughter. But at the same time, Microsoft saw any fans with the fan that would say, No, Switch Apple. You're way off. How could she be in her daughter when she knows there's nothing is like that? But who knows? But I say it's very likely that she could have been Twilight's real daughter. And if you have your own op opinions, your thoughts about this theory, let me know in the comment section below. And as always, subscribe, leave a comment, and as always, this is Switch Down Blue, over and out.